Not so long ago, the Prime Minister indicated that his mind was filled with images of slithering snakes. It was reported in the media. He has moved on since then. The snakes are now replaced in the media reports with blood, slaughter, and murder. He has also held out the prospect of all hell breaking loose. <coughs> These are shocking and disgraceful comments from the supposed leader of the country. He has added them without providing any evidence to back them up. He has linked his predictions of trouble and strife to alleged statements about land by, un by unnamed opposition parties. The violence of his language and his threatening tone takes on a deeper meaning. He wants to frighten you. He wants to frighten us, the voters and candidates and opposition parties, in the desperate hope this will help his doomed bid to avoid defeat on the 14th of December. I have a message to Prime Minister Frank. It will not work. The game is up. He's going to retirement. So he goes across to the opposition benches. Despite protests about his comments, he has not denied them, nor has he shared his, his thinking on exactly who would commit the violence that inhabits his mind. I think his mind is a problem.